the date and time question lets you collect date and time information in a consistent format. It's a brilliant question if you need to collect info like a date of birth or if you need people to tell you when something happened or is going to happen. Just choose a date from the calendar or type it in. Then add a time using the 12 hour clock or the 24 hour clock. The choice is yours. After you've dropped a date and time question into your survey, enter your question text at the top. Then add a label. This appears just above your date and time boxes in the survey. If you need to ask more than one date or time, click the plus button to add more and click the minus button to remove any labels that you don't need. Now you can choose what type of data you'd like to collect. So if you only need to ask for a date, uncheck the time info box so you don't ask for a time in the survey. If you're asking for date info, you can choose the format that makes things easier for your respondents. It's also a good idea to customise your error message to let people know exactly what they need to do if they add an invalid date or time. The Options tab lets you make your question required. If you're asking for multiple dates and times, you can choose how many of them you'd like people to answer. When you have a look at your results, the date and time of each response are shown together. You'll see the date and time they entered into the question at the top, followed by the date and time they submitted their response. Click View Respondents Answers if you want to see how someone answered the rest of your survey.